Hey everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install the Bitwarden desktop application for Linux. So to start off, open up a terminal window and we're going to do the snap installation method here because you know, the there they have uh, the app ready for other distros as well, but uh, the snap version is a bit more universal, so let's go with that. So to start off, open up your terminal, you snap search Bitwarden and uh Again, make sure you have your uh, make sure you have Snap enabled on your system, or you're using something that comes with Snap already, or it's not going to work very well. Then you can just do sudo snap install Bitwarden. Enter your password. It will download everything it needs. And by the way, I'm not going to log into my Bitwarden account. I use it every day for my iPhone, for my Linux PCs. I'm not going to log in because that will reveal my account information and important personal stuff, but I will show you how to install the app and I will launch it. And you can see the login window just so you know it works. Uh, but a as password managers go, it's one of my favorite. Um, you know, it works very well, uh, but uh, I won't be logging into it for you guys to see, sadly, for those of you who wanted to see inside of that. But uh, when the snap is done mounting, we will be able to launch it, so. Bitwarden is right here, and we can open that up. Should take a couple seconds, but it'll be ready to use in a minute. Okay, so with the snap installation done, you can see the Bitwarden application open and ready to use. You can log into your account, or you can create a new setup here, and uh, let's see the settings. You know, you can even have your own self-hosted environment. Bitwarden is awesome. I highly recommend it. If you use LastPass or Dashlane or any of these other apps, just switch to Bitwarden. It's open source. It integrates very well within the iOS password system where I can log into like Twitter with my face. It's pretty nice. I really, really like it. So definitely check it out. Works well with Linux, works well with other systems. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.